Hey guys! Hi! <laughs> Hi from Kayla. <laughs> First off, I'd like to start off this video by apologizing for the fact that in pretty much all of my videos, I'm rocking the mom bun. And there's a really good reason for that. Majority of the time, I'm doing these videos at the end of my day. And like, this is just real life, you guys. This is probably what you're gonna see most days. So, welcome to my mom life. This is what it is. This is what you're gonna get. So this week, I went back to the Dollar Tree and let me tell you guys something. I have never had so much luck at the Dollar Tree. I mean like, in finding things that so many people on YouTube and stuff have been finding, I've never had this kind of luck. It was crazy. I went in specifically looking for certain items and mama found some look at this look at this look at this i know you guys have been seeing these oh hello hello i know you guys have been seeing these picture frames all over youtube and it's those like wooden looking picture frames there were four different like color tones i guess you could say i don't want to say colors i'm really sorry for the glare guys i'm trying to use natural lighting but the sun's going down so clearly that's not working so yeah so i found this blue one which was super pretty and i don't even know if the lighting in here is doing it complete justice but it's beautiful and then sort of like this light grayish tone i guess you could say and then this brown I found this cute, what does it say? It says, you're never too little to dream big. And it's supposed to look like that. I hope you guys can see that. But yeah, it's got this cute doll. And guys, believe it or not, and this is a different Dollar Tree than the last one that I went to, I found more of these plastic bins. They must be coming back out now. And these are the ones that are the drawers that you pull in and out. Let me open it. Anybody else use a knife to cut things open? Because I do. You shouldn't, but I do. So this is, ooh, this is what it looks like. It's just this plastic, but they look so pretty. They definitely look like genuine acrylic. So these are so nice. And I couldn't believe when I found more. When those first came out and they were all the rave, I was not able to find any of them. And so I'm so excited that now they're starting to come back out. And I guess maybe since, you know, the popularity of them has died down a little bit, I'm able to find them and pick them up. So I picked up... Four? I thought I got more than that. See? The whole bag was missing. Look at that. Damn. I picked up six, actually. Six of them. I found this cute, one of my all-time favorite songs to sing to Kayla since she was a baby is You Are My Sunshine. So I found this cute little jar that says You Are My Sunshine and I figured she can put little decorative things in there, maybe some little flowers just to be pretty or she could put some of her art supplies in here too, which is super cute. So I was also able to find, which I was really excited about, these little jars that everyone has been showing. They look like little macaroons. And they have the little heart detail on the front. Again, I'm sorry for my nails, you guys. They're looking pretty ratchet. Ugh, sorry. Yeah, so I was able to find the purple one, which is so cute. And this, like, turquoise teal color, which, again, they open up. So cute with the gold detail. I was shocked. Shocked when I found that. And also, the watermelon candle. That everyone has been hauling and it's just the little mason jar candles that everyone is showing and it smells like a jolly rancher i'm hoping that when i light it it smells like a jolly rancher in the room because it smells so good um one of these little silicone scrubber pad I got it in the turquoise. They had a pink, and I think, I forgot what the other color was. I've seen a couple YouTubers talk about using this to um, clean their makeup brushes, and I was like, that's so smart. So I'm gonna give that a shot. I've seen a couple YouTubers haul these also, and I decided to pick some up, and these are the LA Color Metal. I'm gonna swatch one for you so you can see. The applicator is a doe foot. Oh. It's like really liquidy. I don't know if I like that color. I'm probably gonna give that one to Kayla. And then I got this one, which is like a gold. This one looks like it's gonna be pretty over a lipstick. Ooh. Ooh, 
Ooh, they smell like cupcakes. See? If just for the smell, I will keep it. Then I got another color, but if I didn't like that orange color, I don't know if I'm going to like this one. Oh. Well, all right then, Dollar Tree. This is actually pretty. Over a lipstick. And it has sort of like bluish undertones. That's nice. So far, two out of the three are a win for me. Okay. And now for what I think is one of the most exciting parts of this haul. Like I said in the last haul, Kayla's been super into Legos lately. And so what she's been wanting are some base plates so that she can, you know, start to build her little Lego sets and do all of these things. If you look online, Lego base plates. Now I'm talking about the Lego brand of base plates. I found the basic green one for $5.99 on Amazon. That was the cheapest I could find it. The other colors, I found them upwards of $10, $11 for one base plate. And I was just in shock. The best deal that I could find on Amazon was it was a four pack from another company. I think they're called like Brick City or something like that. And it was a four pack variety colors, a four pack color variety. So it came in like gray, green, blue, and like a sand beige color and that one i think was like 17 dollars. so and they're big 32 by 32 plates so just to kind of give you an overview of what i was finding when i was looking for base plates so that kayla can use them to build on top of now when i went to the dollar tree the other day i wasn't looking for this i decided to take a you know just browse down the toy section and guys i found base plates base plates <laughs> i've never ever seen this at the dollar tree i was looking them up online to see like what this is all about apparently the dollar tree does have their own like little sets of what they call my blocks so it's like the little lego sets they have different like cards and stuff like that but i haven't even seen like even on the dollar tree's website these base plates, I have not seen them. Now granted, they are pretty small. These are, I counted them yesterday, they're 16 by 16, so they're half the size of the ones that you could find on Amazon and stuff, but they are a dollar, you guys. And even though they are smaller, I think they would work to Kayla's benefit because she has the little like individual My City sets. So some of those are pretty um, small. So it would make it easier for her to build on a smaller set like she has the my city at the beach so she would have to build she would need the sand and the sea right so in order for her if i got her the big 32 by 32 there aren't that many pieces in the at the beach set so this is perfect last night i was up so super late and i was like you know what i need to go test these out because i was so shocked i had only bought originally four of the colors so they have gray blue green and granted this is not lego green this is a pretty like muted green color but it's green right and then beige it's coming off like it's coming off as white but it really is like a sand beige because of my wonderful lighting it's looking white but i promise you it's not so i only picked up the four colors because i figured i'll go home i'll give them a try and see if they work for the legos so i came home last night you guys and they work for the legos so this is a dollar tree brand lego base plate and it's from top block and on the side of the plate, it does say Greenbrier International. So that means it is a Dollar Tree product. So when I saw how awesome they work, I obviously went back and got a ton more. I love the smaller plates for her individual sets for things. She's not out here trying to build a city. We don't have space for her to build a city. So at the end of the day, this size is the perfect size for her to build her little sets on. And they are stackable. So at the bottom, they have the pieces so that you can stack them and maybe put layers and stuff like that. The flat pieces go on it. I actually put one of the base pieces um, from one of her other sets on here and it did work also. And then all of the other Legos do as well. I got a couple of Kayla's Lego pieces so I can demonstrate to you guys just really quickly. So this is just a little blue piece like this
it works <laughs> it works and it's on there pretty snug and then the little Lego person just another taller piece and then the flat pieces which I know this is a big this is a big kind of hit or miss thing where if these flat pieces don't work, then it's kind of difficult. But you guys, I'm going to put on the end just because, just so it's easier for me to take off. But yes, they are a little bit harder to push down, but that's normal, right? Look, it's on there. I don't know if you guys can see that, but and it wasn't even that hard to press down. You do have to give it a little bit more push than you would with anything else, but it's on there, you guys, and it's on there snug. Look at that. There you go, you guys. Lego base plates. Well, let me not call them Lego base plates. <laughs> they are my blocks base plates at the Dollar Tree, and they fit Lego. So if you guys are looking for base plates and your kids love Legos and they have all these individual sets, get out to your Dollar Tree now. I'm pretty sure they're going to fly off the shelf. I checked online yesterday to see if they were on the Dollar Tree's website and they are not on the Dollar Tree's website, it seems to be like a store only thing for now. They do have the My Block sets on the Dollar Tree website in like a case of 32 that you can buy. So I don't know if they're going to come out with these eventually online. But if they don't, you guys, I suggest you get to your store as soon as possible to get you some of these because they are great quality and they're only a dollar. I have never seen these in my store before, so I'm super excited. That's why I had to go back and get them today. I got, I went on my lunch break, okay? So that's it, you guys. That is all for this Dollar Tree haul. Thank you guys so much for watching. Please give this video a thumbs up if you love Dollar Tree as much as I do. Be sure to subscribe to our channel so you don't miss any of our upcoming videos. We love you guys, and we'll see you in the next one. Bye. I'm specifically looking for certain items, right? And <laughs> my kid is crawling on the floor. I was trying not to distract you, but you saw me. <laughs> <laughs> Legit crawling on the floor. <laughs> you better keep that in the video now. <laughs> and you know me. Turn the O2 into the O3. Imagine if I never met the Dollar Tree. God's plan. God's plan. Hey. All right. Anyway. <laughs>